What is the CPU? CPU stands for Central Processing Unit. The CPU is the brain of the computer. It sits on the motherboard. It is made up of two parts, the control unit and the arithmetic logic unit. The arithmetic logic unit, or ALU, performs mathematical and logical operations. The control unit is the working part of the CPU and is the part that controls the components of the PC. The central processing unit performs a fetch, decode, execute cycle to process data. To break it down, the fetch part of the cycle is basically where the CPU fetches data from the main memory and then stores the data from the main memory in the CPU registers. A register is a temporary storage area which can hold a single byte of data. They have two wires, a set wire and an enable wire. The program counter copies the address of the next instruction it contains into the memory address register, MAR. Then, the memory address register triggers a read signal that causes the main memory, RAM, to place the instruction being asked for onto the data bus. The data bus and the address bus both consist of a set of eight wires, one for each bit. The instruction on the data bus is loaded to the memory data register, also called the memory buffer register. The memory data register copies the instruction into the instruction register, completing the fetch stage. Next is the decode section. The CPU examines the instruction in the current instruction register and decodes it. This basically means that the CPU will be able to understand what the instruction is. An example is that the instruction might say add. The CPU will decode it to understand what it means and prepares to carry the instruction out. The final stage is the execute section. This is where the CPU will carry out the instructions within the instruction register. Once that instruction has been executed, the cycle starts again from the start for the next instruction.